and good morning, good evening, good afternoon students and traders all around the world. This is the professional forex trading course 101. The third time goes is the saying, so hopefully the sound is okay. <laughs> this is the this is the third stream. Alright, so <laughs> that's the that's the third stream all right all right that's the third stream so workspace open and j 4 x 4 classes and open again we're going to wait for some youtube students to come in and tell me oh boss the sound is all right the sound is okay and we need to check we have the rules for trading the three fibonacci is part one all right everybody let me get back to the trading fibonacci numbers the three fibonacci and multiple time frame trading all right and next level next level next level fibonacci trading week wow we're going to trade the fibonacci so Let's start with this, all right? And then we're going to check again the Fibonacci's, all the pictures, one, contrarian, confirmation, original, all good? All right, so trading Fibonacci numbers, the three Fibonacci's and the multiple time frames. this was from yesterday. This is the most challenging to grasp, all right? because we have the original Fibonacci and the contrarian on the monthly, the original Fibonacci and the contrarian, the original Fibonacci and the contrarian, and on the one hour chart, four hour chart, we have the original Fibonacci and the contrarian, and long or short on the trading time frame. So what we are learning everybody, it's about the probabilities, all right? And it says you have to think in terms of probabilities based on Fibonacci's. It's Forex Course 101 Fibonacci trading charting concept. Number one, decide what pattern Fibonacci, what Fibonacci pattern are you going to trade? Find the best alignments between the tradable patterns. More in the Fibonacci Mastery course, all right. Enter the market according to your strategy. So those are the one, two, three, right? Those are the rules. So decide what pattern Fibonacci you are going to trade. Of course, find the best alignment between the tradable patterns, which would be, it would be better if we change the, so number one would be find the best alignments between the tradable patterns, the, then the side. And number three, enter the market according to the strategy. So here is the question, if you want to make money with the Fibonacci, when different Fibonacci are positioned one against each other, how do you know which one is the best trade in terms of probability? Wow, great question. The answer lies in the alignment on the Fibonacci's first, then alignment with other tools that you are using. Makes sense? So if we go on a more complex situation, and here we have the monthly, here on the weekly, and it's going to be like this all right and give me a second everybody it's all good all right so here is the confirmation fibonacci going down and here is the confirmation fibonacci going up All right, how is the sound, everybody? Sound okay today? The third time goes is the saying. Is it okay, the sound? 
I'm not sure if Trader Sam is here to type in the chat sound okay hopefully today <laughs> the answer lies in the alignment on the Fibonacci's first then alignments with other tools that you are using here is an old picture from the internet if you carefully study the picture you will see at what point the four time frames are aligned and where they are not aligned now this applies to the original Fibonacci, the contrarian Fibonacci and the Fibonacci of the confirmation. Alright everybody? It is hard work I know but believe me with time and practice it gets easier and easier. Forex course 101 Fibonacci trading concept. This doesn't mean that you cannot win on a low probability trade and or lose on a high probability trade. It's still a probability game. But if you're going to trade in the direction of the greatest force alignment, then it's just a matter of time that you will start to understand that what to have an edge means. An edge is going to appear to you after hundreds and hundreds of trades, not just one trade. We take a deep dive about the edge and how institutions come to the edge in the advanced course. So don't worry, you will learn everything and anything on how this business is done, but for now, step by step. Boss, but I don't have time. If you are an advanced trader, you cannot join the Fibonacci signals group. Make no mistakes, I'm not going to tell you where to enter, where to exit, where to profit. This is your job. If you're an advanced trader, you can join the Fibonacci signal group. Make no mistake, I'm not going to tell. But I'm going to tell you when the market comes to high probability levels. Worth it? I don't know, you decide. But anyway, you need to learn how Fibonacci is working in order to take an advantage of the signals mark makes sense there is a secret on why signals don't work right do you know anybody who is making consistent profit with signals buying robots and strategies don't work either right or maybe just maybe maybe just maybe i'm wrong do you know anybody who bought a robot or an expert advisor and got rich or at least is making consistent profits well i don't Get this, my strategy has a proven edge. My strategy is nothing special in the end using Fibonacci, but it's making me consistently money for the last past eight years. And I give it for free to all my Forex course to, to students. Only 2% make money. Out of 100 students, only 2%, only two make consistent money with my strategy. Why? Well, it's the same logic on why signals don't work for you and it never will. And here is the secret. You cannot understand a strategy, signal or methodology unless you understand the mindset that built that strategy. Wow. All right, everybody. So talking about that's the game, right? And it's called alignments. All right. It's called alignments. So you need to rules, what right? rules, right? So let's type down some rules. Rules number one: find the best alignment. Find the best alignment. Okay. Number two. Choose what pattern to trade. Number three, don't forget that the original FIBOS are the driving force. Choose what pattern to trade, all right? Number four, before you enter the trade, confirm 
at least two time frames that the pattern that you chose goes in the same direction. All right, everybody. Those are the rules. Try to find the best alignment. Align uh, type one here at the table. Alignment. Alignment. Choose what pattern to trade. Don't forget that the original Fibonacci's are the driving force. Before you enter the trade, confirm at least two Fibonacci, two time frames that the pattern that you choose goes in the same direction. All right. Now let's do a live example, everybody. So we're going to go. We're going to open AUD USD. I'm not sure if I have all the Fibonacci's there, but. All right, so this is AUD USD monthly chart. All right, everybody, you have the original Fibonacci ABC. You have the contrarian. Did I save it? Oh, we have it. All right, all good. You have the contrarian going up, and you have the confirmation, right? Sub sub A, sub sub B, sub sub C, and this week you would win if you would do what? What is the market telling you? Maybe, you know, maybe, just maybe, right? Anyway, talking about alignments, so trend line if you want trend line and trend line and like this all right everybody so how are the how are the fibonacci is aligned is down right There was a big retracement from the monthly and then the market start pushing down. Agreed everybody? Market start pushing down. Can you see it? Short term is different. Yes. In talking about from the monthly Talking about talking about general direction and alignments, right? So just bear in mind this picture. All right, down original Fibonacci. We have a conformity and the market price action. No one candle. It's not enough. Just bear in mind that you have the confirmation Fibonacci going down. And this sub sub C is confirmed to make sense. And then the market is doing different stuff in between. All right. All right. So now we go on the weekly chart and we're trying to find alignment. So question is the original Fibonacci from the monthly Everybody, I need you to focus right now. Is the original Fibonacci aligned with the monthly? Are those two aligned? Boss, what does this mean? That they are going in the same direction. Yes, they are exactly. Now, because the market's falling down, yes, this is how your chart should be right now. All right, 
So talking about the short term trends, you know, and here and yellow and a transparency, transparency. Wow, nice, nice features, right? Do you agree, everybody, that price action is down generally, in general? All right, so is the confirmation Fibonacci from the monthly and the weekly RD, English grammar, RD, confirmation Fibonacci is from the monthly and the weekly aligned. Again, boss, what does this mean? They are going in the same direction. Yes, they are, exactly. Now I didn't, oh, so this is still the contrarian, this time we don't have a confirmed, so yeah, give me a second, sub, sub, a, sub, sub, a, right click, clone, Right click, edit label, sub sub B, right click, clone, right click, edit label, sub sub A, sub sub B, sub sub C, right click one more time, and then we have the right click and edit label sub sub d right so sub sub a sub sub b confirmation fibonacci sub sub c it's not confirmed and of course the sub sub d is down in here on the weekly all right And if I'm not mistaken, right? It's green goes to green sub sub C. I'm not sure about this one. Oh, this was this is the confirmation Fibonacci on the confirmation, but I'm going to take it out. Okay, everybody, let's check if I if I made some mistakes, right? Let us double check. So, one, two, this is the third one. And there you go. Let's zoom in. All right, so it looks like this is not the low. Widget, give it a second and 762, 7621, 7, 76213, 76213. So this is lower. Alright, so the first one is alright. Green goes to green. That's the low. The second one, green, still green, goes to green all right that's it i believe we made no mistakes right everybody give me a second
everybody, sorry about that. So we have the sub sub C, it's not conformed anyway, the market's going down. So the alignment is between the monthly and the weekly, agreed? All right, now if I go to the daily, and find the daily and get rid of this one and this one so the daily original Fibonacci if I'm not mistaken is this one and blue goes to blue right blue goes to blue give me a second everybody Six three one hundred. Six three one hundred. All right. Six three one hundred. This one maybe. Six three. Okay. That's the original Fibonacci. A B C. It went to red. Right. So here is the question: Are the monthly original Fibonacci and the weekly original Fibonacci? And the daily original Fibonacci, are those Fibonacci's aligned? Yes, they are, right? Yes, they are. Are the confirmation Fibonacci's aligned from the monthly, weekly and daily? Yes, they are too, right? So, do we have or don't we have great alignment? Out. See everybody why the contrarian Fibonacci on the confirmation Fibonacci lost? Because of the alignments, the alignments are the strongest force. Sub sub A is up in here. This is the confirmation Fibonacci on the original one, sub sub A. Clone, right click, edit label, sub sub B, right click, clone, right click, edit label, sub sub C, sub sub is down in here, sub sub C, it's up in here, didn't hit the blue, so green goes to green, and clone, the last time sub sub D. Is done in here. All right, everybody. So, talking about the Fibonacci alignments, see what it's happening. I mean, in the midterm, the market's going through wave and retrace, but nonetheless, what it's happening? Isn't the daily falling down to the sub sub the extension? Aren't we trading this one going down to the sub sub D extension? Everybody? Can you see it? Boss, how do you trade with confidence? You need to train alignments, the understanding of the alignments. If you go, if you do an exercise like this, and it's practice, 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 you have the monthly original Fibonacci going down, you have the confirmation Fibonacci going down, this is just one, then you go on the weekly chart, and you see that on the weekly chart, the original Fibonacci is going down to 
the confirmation Fibonacci is going down to the market wave is going down to it's waving the shortened trend is going down to it's waving and nonetheless or lastly the daily Fibonacci is going down to and the confirmation Fibonacci on the daily is going down to and you can connect on Skype with my Forex course to two students and ask them that I'm telling them from the beginning of the year AUDUSD it's a short short the market short 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 it's a Fibonacci play day trader sure we talk about retracement too but general direction alignment most of you everybody have a difficult time in the Fibonacci mastery with alignment boss I don't understand alignment remember this is no advice or investment advice or trading advice talking about direction I'm taking the trade shorting the market until down to here on AUDUSD but you must understand why are you doing this make sense what does the manual say what does the manual say we just read the quote what does the manual say you cannot understand a strategy signal or methodology unless you understand the mindset that build that strategy signal or methodology oh I'm going to short the market because you are shorting the market doesn't work you need to learn this everybody you need to learn about the alignment so me personally I'm shorting it I'm shorting AUD USD all right now let's do the same and let's go on NZD USD NZD USD let's make a poll everybody what do you think NZD USD buy or sell as general direction buy or sell as general direction it's the same process exactly we start with the monthly all right we go on the monthly give me a second all right monthly chart ends the USD and you see that on the monthly chart if I'm not mistaken highs and lows high to for no lows no lows everybody give me a second just to double check just to double check again well it's the monthly chart right we can uh, all right first we need to save original Ebo. save so I'm going to zoom in and there was a low there it is that's a low so monthly chart ends the USD A to B all right then that's the A to B right then out this one and 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 so this is the oh it's red to red right red goes to red so this is the most recent original Fibonacci on NZD USD monthly chart that's the A up in here that's the A whoops reset now 24 all right that's the A that's the B up in here is going to be the C 
all right so ANSD USD monthly chart the original Fibonacci capital ABCD is down the confirmation Fibonacci is down right sub sub A sub sub A right click clone give me a second right click whoops right click edit label sub sub B right click clone down in here right click edit label sub sub C and right click clone down in here edit label sub sub D look at ANZD USD is going down right that's the monthly now going to the weekly we are looking there is a reason why this market is falling all right then we go on the weekly chart and we look for alignments weekly chart zoom out trying to find the bigger picture or the big picture what can you see so from the monthly chart the the original Fibonacci is down isn't the original Fibonacci from the weekly down to we just found another alignment between the monthly and the weekly original Fibonacci capital A capital B capital C up in here and the projected it went to red so projected the extension is going to be down in here that's the way what about the confirmation Fibonacci isn't the confirmation Fibonacci going in the same direction and it's aligned with the confirmation Fibonacci on the monthly sub sub a everybody right click clone edit label this is going to be the sub sub b right click clone this is going to be the edit label this is going to be the sub sub c sub sub b down here and sub sub c clone green goes to green right click edit label this is the sub sub d boss should we go short talking about fibonacci alignments the answer is yes i mean remember this room is no investment on trading advice advice but because of the Fibonacci alignments we just covered we just covered AUD USD now we have the NZD USD the original Fibonacci is down down direction the confirmation Fibonacci is down direction everybody give me a second I believe somebody oops in clicking here give me a second everybody Now we go on the daily and zoom out, zoom in and zoom out. So here is the daily. What is the daily original Fibonacci telling you? That's the A. So we found the third alignment between the original Fibonacci's. Exactly the same happened on 
AUD USD. That's the A on NZD USD daily chart. That's the B on NZD USD daily chart. That's the C on NZD USD daily chart. Red goes to red, right? And down in here, this is going to be the projected the extension. So the three Fibonacci's, the three original Fibonacci's on the monthly, weekly, daily on A on NZD USD, they are aligned. Clinton, hello, I shorted the market at 664. Congratulations. Looks like sound sound is okay today. <laughs> we have some sound problems for the last today two days. As the saying goes, the third way it goes. So this is the original Fibonacci going down alignment and here you have everybody the confirmation Fibonacci going down too. This is the confirmation. Can you see it everybody? So talking about alignments and the greatest force, all right, and talking about Fibonacci's, you should be shorting, I mean in the, we are clear that the market must wave, right? But there is a reason, you know, and we clarified how the market moves, extension, retracement, extension. Now this one, the smaller one if you want, now this is the confirmation Fibonacci on the confirmation. You know, if you... Slide number three, exactly. You know, the entries on the confirmation Fibonacci and right, oops, give me a second. If I do like this and click, it's not going to appear. Color, there you go. So the entries on the confirmation Fibonacci was here, right? And was here and it was here. But we are in here right now. Right click, all right. So if you want, you can put a confirmation Fibonacci on a confirmation Fibonacci. No, there is no right or wrong. It's it's all about alignments. All right, alignments. What's the time? Everything is aligned. Well, again, if you are a short-term day trader scalper then you're going to trade the differently by the way you cannot scalp the Fibonacci talking about day trading it's a different strategy yes four hour two I'm not I'm not sure if I have it on give me a second everybody and So this is the 4 hour Fibonacci, there you go, hit the extension, give me a second, green goes to green, so the Fibonacci is now this would be the new one, see how this goes? Okay, so we checked AUD USD alignments between the Fibonacci's monthly, weekly, daily. We checked NZD USD alignments on the monthly, weekly, daily. All right, and now let's do the same on some of you are late, everybody. Now we're going to do the same on your dollar, all right. 
for you to understand why in the trading session I'm talking to my student traders in the Forex course 202 we are shorting NZD USD we are shorting AUD USD we are shorting euro dollar and rules for trading the three Fibonacci find the best alignment choose what pattern to trade meaning which one of those Fibonacci don't forget that the original Fibonacci are the driving force before you enter the trade confirm at least two time frames that the pattern you chose goes in the same direction those are the rules for trading the three Fibonacci you have a choice you can trade the original one you can trade the contrarian you can trade the confirmation all right so now let's go on the last one for today it's going to be euro dollar boss can I trade differently you can do whatever you want to attain consistency you must understand what you are doing does this make sense everybody? To attain consistency, you must understand what you are doing. Now, before we finish the and it's Friday and we go on a weekend. You know, there is Euro dollar monthly chart right and I didn't save it yet I believe so save save original FIBO and here and save contrarian FIBO save and this one save Oh, we have it, original Hugo, right? All right. So, we have the confirmation Fibonacci too. Here one, and here, and Contra. No, I need this one to be safe. Save original Fibonacci. Save. Okay. Now we are good. So click in here and here and original Fibonacci. This is just the this is just the the monthly. Alright? Just the monthly. Yeah, I would not be, I would, I don't, in my opinion, you know, consolidation, I don't know, maybe. But this market is falling, see? Just bear in mind, we just did this on AUDUSD, we did this on NZDUSD, now we let's do this on Euro Dollar. Bear in mind this picture, original Fibonacci is down, confirmation Fibonacci is down, market is falling right f11 let's go on the weekly that's from the classes out 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 you zoom out everybody that's from the classes now the weekly euro dollar original fibonacci is here a b c is down we have an alignment yeah I need to speed up all right confirmation Fibonacci boss but we have the contrarian too all good confirmation Fibonacci going down too right so we just have an alignment between the monthly original Fibonacci 
and the weekly original Fibonacci on euro dollar and the monthly and weekly confirmation Fibonacci and this is why seven times seven times out of ten the driving force is this one on the weekly blue goes to blue down in here and the last one everybody if we go on the daily that's the system that doesn't matter if you go on the daily the daily is up so we don't have we don't have an alignment between the original ones plural the alignment is just between the monthly and the weekly right but now we have the confirmation is going up on the original one and now let's see if we play the contrarian from here to here if we play the contrarian on the original one on the daily how this is going to play out left click here this one all right so white goes to white that's the C this would be and the market just hit the, the extension violet goes to violet see everybody in conclusion listen up in conclusion the best alignment now AUD USD and NZD USD those were easy euro dollar best alignment best alignment monthly short weekly short daily short the contrarian Fibonacci because because is aligned with the monthly and weekly they are going in the same direction everybody do a copy academy is going to put this stream on youtube channel all right so if fibonacci works the fibonacci the monthly and the weekly if fibonacci theory works the monthly and the weekly fibonacci are going to break the original fibonacci on the daily wow right so boss what do you mean do you mean that if i'm buying euro dollar am i trading on the lower probability side and the answer is yes everybody okay those are alignments that being said have a great weekend everybody i'm happy that sound is back normally until Monday, stay strong and chart and study the Fibonacci alignment like a ball.